CPS, the bold and the beautiful spoilers reveal that Steffi's very pleased when things are going so well for Taylor. Ridge has decided to get back with Taylor. This is Steffi's long-standing wish. She's about to live in a happy family with a full father and mother. Steffi flew back to Los Angeles to give Ridge and Taylor some space. By chance, she ran into Brooke again at the airport. Steffi, of course, didn't pass up a great opportunity like this to mock Brooke. She was overjoyed when she saw that Brooke couldn't hold on to Bridge. Brooke will forever be a loser. Brooke is very angry, and she promises to make Taylor parents pay. Meanwhile, Finn has been standing out here waiting for Steffi. He, of course, heard the news that Steffi was coming back, so he came here to pick her up, but the two of them won't go home immediately. Steffi and Finn would love to have some space together. There have been a lot of problems lately, so the two of them can't focus on love. Steffi had just also helped Taylor relax, so he followed his mother to Aspen. Finn is just waiting for Steffi to come back and warm up with her. Finn had experienced near death once, so now he cherished the moment the two of them were together. Steffi and Finn will have a meal at the French restaurant before heading home. In another development, Eric and Donna are arguing very vehemently. So in the end, the problem between Brooke and Rich affects quite a lot of Donna and Eric's relationship. Of course, the cause of Donna and, and Eric's quarrel was related to Thomas as well, because Donna believes that Thomas is the one who harmed Brooke, then caused Brooke and Ridge's mar marriage to fall apart. But Donna's opinion was strongly opposed by Eric. Eric th thought that Donna was too suspicious to determine that Thomas was the culprit. Maybe it's because Donna doesn't like Thomas that she doesn't think well of him. Only now did Eric receive this bad score from Donna. It annoyed Eric quite a bit, and he remembered Quinn again. Eric regrets that he chose Donna over Quinn.